Uh, hello everyone, uh, welcome back. Uh, in this tutorial, I am going to design a uh, circular shape uh, antenna. Uh, so, it will be planar antenna. So, for that, I have selected now uh, so time domain, frequency domain uh, at uh, hertz frequency band. So, uh, dimension of uh, dimension will be in micrometer. So uh, frequency I will change, I will select later in when I will want to simulate my antenna. So first of all, uh, I will like to design a ground plane. But before, before, before that I will select a local WCSS and uh, I will now I will go to simulation window and here I will select sorry modeling window and here I will select uh, ground ground plane now the length of of ground plane will be uh, sorry the width of ground plane will be minus WG divided by WG divided by 2 plus WG divided by 2 similarly length will be equal to minus LG divided by 2 minimum 2 control V uh, height of the ground plane will be HG and both ground plane I will select with the Q, uh, PC perfect electric conductor okay uh, width of the ground will be equal to what uh, let's select 664 micrometer and uh, 522 micrometer and uh, height of ground will be 0 0.01 micrometer okay if you see here this is our ground now we'll uh, need to make a substrate for that I have selected this option uh, by clicking uh, F or either either you can select paste with the help of center A or with the help of what let's so I have selected this uh, paste with the help of let's control Z here is a select paste sorry shortcut I remember the shortcut but I don't don't did not remember a uh, uh, big face center is selected face center but with the help of um, F option uh, by pressing F in the keyboard you will select your face now we'll need to extrude this and uh, extrude will make a substrate so for that Block. I am giving it name of substrate. Substrate, and uh, I will select the height of substrate. This will be the H's height of substrate. H will H representing height, and uh, this is representing substrate. Now I will choose polyamide. Polyamide lies loss. So okay, height will be 10 micrometer. Okay, now. If you see, um, here is the ground plane, ground plane, and this is the substrate. Before that, I am removing gray, so now you can easily see the selected shape is ground while other one is substrate you can see it all is like this this 
this is ground and the second one is substrate okay now we'll need to uh, to bring WSSS to at the top of at the top face of uh, substrate so for that I will uh, I have selected uh, this space and by pressing W you can get WCSS at the uh, top of uh, substrate now I will design and I will uh, need to design uh, what I will need to design circular shape so for that I will select a cylinder and now I am giving it a name of page and uh, here I will select the radius for page so that will be um, equal to and now change I need to change material I have selected now PC perfect electric conductor if I will review so you will get um, you will get length of the uh, substrate that will be uh, sorry radius of the page will be equal to uh, 250 micrometer okay so you you can see this it is a large page I think I doesn't need it in the in this shape so I need to uh, reduce its size now I should I will select 130 micrometer if I will review it review it now here you can see uh, this is our page antenna okay now we will need to um, assign micro strip peat so for that I will again select a peat peat and peat will begin from this point to that point so for that I will select minus W so here uh, I will I will select first of all this point so actually this is a minus V and it is, uh, it is starting from minus LG by 2 and now it will come to our here the dead point so this is actually uh, LG um lg l minus uh, lg divided by sorry minus lg uh, minus lp divided by 2 and width of the speed will be minus w divided by 2 WF divided by 2 and height of the page will be equal to H. Now, if review it, I need to choose 80 micrometer. Uh, sorry, LP. If that is not actually LP, it is a R. Review it. Oh, so very small so I think I need to change the formula now here you see it is almost equal to that point but here is small gap oh, I think I, I should reduce this so uh, I will 8 plus 5 now if you see it is still very small I think I should add plus 10 now preview it now it's quite enough ok if we see side view of this these two is almost equal ok I doesn't I I have rem, I have forgot the height of page antenna so I think I should change it by pressing control I 
you will come to property and then you will select this and then you will edit and here will, you will give height of edge preview ok so here you can see now page is ready ok now I will add this page so I will come to boolean option and then I will add and then I will select feed ok now uh, I will need uh, to design a bone or a cylinder which will represent a head so actually I want to bend this my antenna so for that I will uh, so I will that for that I will come minus this point at the at that uh, level at that level so for that I will come to uh, local WCSS and I will transform now uh, if you see this is W W direction so in minus W direction I will write minus H is let's preview it so here I have come or here now I need to come at the low point of the ground so again the height of the ground is uh, minus H is so minus H is so far that I have also written minus H G. if I play, if you see if you see so this is our point first of all I will come here and then after that I will uh, come at the low uh, pace of the ground let's zoom it now you can clearly see what I am going to do H is so by pressing H is you will get uh, this WCS will come to this point let's preview it here you can see uh, now uh, again I'm coming to add HG if you see you have come to the lower end of the uh, ground pad. ok now I will uh, design um, cylindrical shape cylinder it will be quite large this radius will be red and uh, it will start from minus um, let's see what's happen its length is 500 and its length uh, is uh, let's suppose 2000 ok now preview it uh, it is in the direction of uh, w axis it means it is vertical and uh, I need it in the v direction so for that I am selecting and now preview it choose L ok it is beginning it is starting <coughs> it is starting from 0 so I will need to make uh, its center at uh, minus W direction 
controls here. Control V. Minus W. It will now be neat. It will be neat our uh, antenna. But if you see, it is beginning from zero, from this point. And actually, I want need this from minus L divided by 2 to L divided by 2. Now if you see, uh, it will show it like this. So, if you see our antenna, okay, I think now I need to assign material to proper material, sorry. I will come to change material and uh, I think I need vacuum over here so by pressing ok if you see now you can see our rectangular shape antenna is ready but it is straight it is not bended and uh, I want to bend it uh, according to uh, this cylindrical circle so for that I will select first of all fetch then I will select substrate and then I will uh, select ground and now I will come to bend shape you can uh, bend your uh, this these selected object with the help of control B or either you can click on bend and now you will select uh, object uh, select object or uh, you will select that ob uh, object according to which you want to uh, bend your um, uh, antenna so I want to bend my antenna according to this cylindrical shape so now I will select and uh, by pressing enter or double uh, clicking on this space you will bend your Here if you want to uh, bend your object, so for that you will come to, you will need to connect, uh, select fetch, substrate and then the bend option and then you will select on cylinder and after that you will click on this. So now you can see here, 